Okay, so here's my new electronics bench I've got already built. It was a free bench. Uh, I just had to make wooden legs for it, and my room is pretty much still a mess. Uh, but I've got this replication here of my Posco's uh, transistor oscillator using to heat up uh, a little small wire thingamajigs. And uh, I got some wire here probably some old wire, I think my friend gave it to me, and uh, these are IRFP 360s, uh, I've got them up, hooked up in this circuit here, coming off this uh, film capacitor, and then into this uh, flyback transformer. Now the flyback transformer seems to perform better with the magnet attached than without the magnet attached, so I was wondering what would happen if the whole thing was like a magnet, you know, a, a neodymium magnet, you know, if you had a neodymium flyback or something. You know, I'm I'm hoping to get a better flyback. This one's doing an okay job, but my MOSFETs still heat up. They're still heating up, and he's saying that he doesn't get any heat on his on his MOSFETs. So um, yeah, let's hook her up and see what happens. Okay, so uh, we're just gonna hook it up, and I'll show you what happens when I hook it up. Can't really show you everything at the same time, but you'll know when it's turned on here. All right, it's turned on, and check it out. Okay, we just got to uh, turn, turn it off and turn it on again, I think. Uh, hold on. There we go. It's actually performing a little better than this. Let me just make sure I got my voltage up all the way. There we go. Look at that. That's pretty awesome. And my MOSFETs are a little hot. Little, they're, they're not hot. They're actually just a little warm to the touch. Now they're getting hotter. And right now we're at 5.1415 volts. We got this thing like cherry red hot. <laughs> so, that's pretty cool, Mapazco. That's awesome. That's frequency heating uh, with uh, the uh, transistor oscillator. Yeah. So, uh, next step is to make cold electricity with this. I'm, I think I can use this circuit. So, uh, he said I could. So, I'm going to unplug this. And that goes off. These are a little bit warm. Yeah, those are hot. Those are definitely hot now. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to get some different MOSFETs like he recommended I did. I should do, and I'm just waiting on those to order that. So uh, yeah, I was running that off of that battery there, um, but now I'm running it off the uh, power supply, and I got my uh, signal generator. I've got another circuit up there I was working on. You can make uh, little signals. Uh, power lights on and off at a certain interval and different things. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, but I want to see if I can power electromagnets with cold electricity, see if I can power them cold. Um, also working on, um, oh, what's it called? A cryo or, um, uh, uh, well, it's a special type of motor that I'm working on that that can uh, produce cold electricity as well. Crom ray converter, that's what's called the Crom ray converter. So, yeah, I'm making my own Crom ray converter. Just got to machine parts. I just figured out how to machine parts on my uh, on my um, on my machine, on my lathe, so uh, hopefully you can see I'm not blurry. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to be working on that. I got my lathe uh, to machine steel so I can make my own parts. Woohoo! <laughs> Alright, catch you all later.